Hello everyone, this is Realis, and I'm going to be showing a little bit of uh, ragdoll physics in Metroid Prime number one for the Nintendo GameCube. Some troopers are supposed to fall down into the water that are already dead. Maybe not. Okay. As you can see, I'm obviously in the water. Um, now, besides the ragdoll physics, when you shoot the pirates, I'm going all the way back to phase on mines to show you this. So I have to backtrack a lot. But um, the morph ball mode utilizes the physics system. And let me see if I can get those guys to fall down. It, I, I just had to come back through here to get the... Um, Artifact of the Warrior. There we go. See? Okay, I'm going to go to Phase on Mines. There's nothing really else to see here, so I will turn it back on when I get there. Okay, here we are at Phase on Mines. And if I can shoot one of the troopers close enough to the edge, you'll see him realistically fall off. There we go. That was a little bit of action. Let's see if I can get another one to fall off. As you can see, that wasn't the best um, demonstration, but whoa! Here, I'll get I'll get this guy off. Or not. Anyways, they're not pre-animated. I really, really wish you could. Their bodies would stay longer, and you could like um throw them around with your grapple beam, but obviously the GameCube couldn't handle that many bodies on screen at the same time, so hopefully they'll have more physic interaction with the ragdolls in the next game.